Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me, and welcome back to the long, dark, winter mute. This is chapter three, and so we are going to head out here. We have to find Thompson's Crossing, and I'm not sure where it's at. So I'm thinking we should probably go back to Molly, to Molly's cabin and see what's going on. Let's see if we can head back over to Molly's cabin, or farmhouse, and see if she can tell us where to find Thompson's Crossing. I'm not sure... If she'll be of any help, because we did rummage through her stuff. But we can always hope. Alright. I should probably go through that car in a minute, but let's see if she'll let me in. We're warm. We could use a little bit of water, looks like, but... I think we're going to be all right for right now. It's locked. All right, let's go jump in this car right quick and see what we can find. I figured it was going to be locked, but you know what? What's that over there? Is that Thompson Crossing over there? She said stay out of her stuff, but you know what? I don't really feel like listening to her. I always look in these visors, and there's never anything in these visors. Ever. Never has been. There's nothing there. How about in the trunk? That's locked. Okay, well. We head back this way. Radio tower's right there, but... We have seven rounds. Where's the wolf? Where is he? Right in front of me. He just killed a rabbit. I can hurt it. Is that him right there? That's the dead wolf. Alright, we're just going to stay here on the road. We're going to head this direction. <laughs> oh yeah, it's getting cold. The road to the community hall. Let's hope. Let's go, let's go. going to run when we can. That was the, that was the, um, is he coming? Is he going to, are they going to attack me? All right. See if I can make it in this car. Here we go. All right, what's in here? Anything? Nothing. I don't know if the wolf's out there or not. Let's go. All right. All right, we, we might be okay. Heartbreak Ridge, maybe. Heart, Heartbreak Ridge. There's another bigger um, barn over there to the left. this prison well, guard prison guard oh shit take that knife i could use this yeah <laughs> i could use this to we'll search him or a penitentiary memo to read it uh, we, we've arranged additional officers for the upcoming inmate transferred roads and conditions have never been good on great bear but this time of year i'm hearing they're even worse than usual let's make sure we have enough help where and where we need it as you know this uh, but this bunch won't make it easy on us okay I'll take it. That's all he's got on him. We gotta go. I'm getting really cold. There's a deer, but I, you know, I've got a knife on me. But I think we might wait. I got a couple granola bars. They're gonna be okay.
be really nice if I had more gear, but we just started the game, so I'm not too worried about it. Can't feel your feet. I know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Settle down. You only get a sprain. Looks like they added some stuff. God, it's been a while. Every time I say something, I hear a dog bark or a wolf bark. Chasing a rabbit. Hey, beef jerky. It's moldy, though. I have to kill this wolf. That trunk's locked. There's never anything in the hood. Let's go in here and see what's up. This barn might give us some stuff. But there's a bunch of wolves here. I get a few more rounds. Where is he? Get out of my face, dog. It's a goddamn freezing. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Cool. There is another burn barrel in here. There's a pickup truck in here. So let's see what we got. Tools, we'll take them. We'll take the scrap metal. You know what? I don't have any gloves on, do I? All right. There's a bow. Thank you. Cool. And an arrow. And I'll take that lantern. Let's put this gun away. Arrowhead, maybe. We might be able to use it. I don't know. Not for a while, though. Anything underneath? Nope. Okay. You get up and down really slow, because it's so cold, maybe? Maybe that's why. Alright, I am freezing, though, so we got to be super careful. Uh, nothing in the glove box. Anything in the, in the back? There's another bedroll. There's a backpack. Let's search that. Scarf, wooden matches. I'll take that bedroll. I'll break down the other bedroll. Did it automatically put my scarf on? It did. Okay, good. Oh, I, I do have gloves. Okay, that's cool. And I've got a hat, so we're good. All right, cool. It's so cold. You know what? I just want to lay down for a Let's bit. Let's start a fire right quick. Um, we got plenty of coal. This is going to give us several hours of um of fire, so we're going to be good. All right, cool beans, <sighs> and let's add coal. That's two and a half hours. That's good. Take all this stuff. I'm probably going to have to drop some because we're not, we don't really have the carry weight, I don't think. Let's see what we got in the way of carry weight. Uh, 41 and it's 66 pounds. So we have some, but not a ton. And you know, it allowed me to use coal right away. You still have to wait for an hour to heat that fire up. I think that dog food. There's some accelerant, windbreaker, tear some of this stuff down in a minute. What time, er, okay, so it's going to get dark in a minute, guys. Arrow shaft, can I make an arrow? I don't think, I, I don't know if I can make an arrow. I need crow feathers for that, but these shafts are going to help. Oh, hang on, back it up. There we go. Take that book. 
in the shirt. What's in here? Nothing? Okay. All right. So. Pry bar, baby. Yeah. Trunks. The, the car trunks are open to me now. Shirt leather, cardboard matches. Matches are good, man. Oh, metal container. This is cool. Revolver cartridge. Revolver cartridge. Revolver cartridge. Ragged toque and a firearm cleaning kit. I'll take them. Looks like this has been here a while. Yeah, but you know what? The condition's really good on it. Some of this food we're going to have to throw away, guys. Because, like, it, it's no good. Like... All right, food-wise, we're chucking this. We're chucking that. We're chucking this. And we're chucking that. And we're also chucking this. And we're chucking that. It's no good. Oh, that too. That's got to go. Used to be you could go ahead... Oh, did I not boil that water? All right, so it used to be you could go ahead and eat uh, the orange food when the durability was low when you first got it right away. I don't know if that's still the case, so I'm not going to risk it right now. Like, right after you picked it up, you could eat it. I don't, But I'm not going to trust it. Oh, we need some more tinder. Oh, I can't jump here. I can't jump in this game. Is I, Why can't I get... There we go. I was like, why can't I not get past this? Go ahead and uh, let's break this down. 20 minutes? Uh, 27 minutes. I don't want to waste my, my knife. It's going to get dark. Do another 30 minutes. All right. Super dark now. Down the stairs. Hopefully we don't sprain our ankle. And let's go ahead and do some water. Boil that water. I thought I fast forwarded this, but there we go. And take it. How much fire do I need? Add fuel. We got 47 minutes. We'll use another thing of coal. It's four hours. I'll take one torch. And go ahead and cook some water. And while that's cooking, let's go ahead and drink some water. Actually, you know what? Let's eat first. Uh, food's not too bad, but we'll eat this candy bar. And hopefully we'll find food tomorrow. All right, and then we'll drink. How much water do I have left? 0.38 gallons? Okay. Base. Alright, and then base that. Alright, so that's boiled. We'll take that. Boil some more water. And click on it. Space. I'm passing time if you're wondering what I'm doing with the space bar. Otherwise, you got to wait. So there we go. Alright, so we'll go ahead and take that. And pick it up. I think that's going to be enough for me. 0.64 gallons. It's not great, but my carry weight right now is 49 out of 66 pounds. So you know, you know what I could do. Now we can. We, we're going to go ahead and we're going to jump in the in this in this vehicle real quick, and we're going to sleep. Uh, we're going to rest. Sleep just for an hour. Actually, this truck will keep me uh, keep me rested for nine hours, or keep me rested and warm, just warm enough. So that's what we're gonna do. It's been a while since I played the game, guys. So bear with me. We'll do eight hours, and I got two thousand calories, and I'm gonna burn four eighty by sleeping. But hopefully, it'll be light when we get get done here. Should be good. The morning yet? Not yet. Getting low on water, so, but I think we're going to be okay. Sun's about to come up, so we'll sleep for another hour or two. We're plenty warm. You know what? Let's drink. Yeah, let's drink our water. Why not? going to be all the water we have, I think. Nope. 
All right, so we'll sleep for two more hours. Okay. All right. Well, that's cool. And it's light time. It's light time. It's light time. All right. Let's go ahead and see how many how many rounds do we have for this revolver now. Ten. All right. So we're good. We are going to need to find food and water very, very soon. So let's leave the barn house. Hopefully there's not like a really bad storm. That That's what usually gets me is a really bad storm. All right. So I have got to make it back out on the road. But let's check... Hey. Hmm. Oh, it's yeah. good too. I need to put away this. Let me reload that. Oops. So, where are we? Is that where we need to be? Black Rock. We found our way into, into Pleasant Valley. Investigate to see if the events in Knowlton have followed you through the mountains. Okay, well, means I gotta go west. Oh, this deer scared the crap out of me, dude. But I don't know which way is west, so. I'm right here. Well, we're gonna head this way. Oh, really, dude? Get out of my way, dude. Look how fast this, you know what, we might want to wait. I just wasted a shot, but I think we might want to wait. It's too cold out there right now. It's way too cold. It's warm here now. Go ahead and put this away. I think we have to wait till noon. So we're going to sleep for a couple more hours. Uh, three more hours. All right, sounds like the winds died down, so we're probably good. Hopefully I killed that wolf. That would be nice. Still three three arrows down on the on the on the cold. So I'm not happy with that, but we we'll do what we gotta do. Okay, so I think this is the way back out. Hopefully he didn't get frisky with me, this guy. I was going after that deer. That's good. Now that he's doing that, I can run. We'll walk when we have to, but I'm gonna I'm try to sprint if I can. Use a lot of calories, but I'm gonna get out on this road. Where is he, buddy? I you know I don't want to mess with you right now, but I'm gonna. He's bleeding. He should probably fall over dead in a minute. Where am I on the map? I'm going the opposite direction from where I need to be. Are you serious? Uh, I'm not. Well, I'm not. It says to do that, but I'm not gonna. We're going. We're going this way. I may have to go back there, but for right now, I'm not gonna. I think it's a, it looks like a secondary side quest. Like, it might give me some more gear, but I think we're going to be all right.
If I can get better clothes, we'd be better better off. Okay, there's some smoke coming up from over there. That's cool. from the flyer yes it is stop i mean you can't walk and talk at the same time <laughs> i'm freezing to death out here we're freezing to death out here let's go i imagine i'm gonna get set upon by at least one more wolf before we get there though did i say i hate being cold does it really do? No, you never did, but I'm glad to, it's good to know. All right, we got a pickup truck. Probably jump in here and see what's up. And I'm hungry, too. Nothing there, but we'll take those driving gloves for leather later on. Or cloth, or whatever. Nothing back in here? Okay. Yeah, we're getting hungry for sure, for sure. We'll probably pick it up. Pick up the pace a little bit. That fire might warm me up a little bit. Ah, oh, has it been burned down? I think there's a store here on the other side of this bridge. Mining town. It used to be anyway. Damn, I'm freezing. Oh, cool. That's got to be the community hall. No, they put this in, guys. This is cool. This is new. At least to me. Empty, huh? Oh, that's community hall for sure, for sure. I'll take the, the licks with the, with the cold here. Just so I can search these vehicles. All right. Is it warm? No. All right, here we go. Somebody's in there. Okay. Islands gardens for island people. Grow local. Let me in! I have arrived. It's okay. It's all right. I've arrived. But don't mind me while I go through your stuff. I have to use the toilet. I'm going to read this newspaper while I'm in here. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take everything. Probably be able to... No, I can't dig those curtains. A lot of frozen people here. I need food. You got any food before I talk to you? We're searching through everything. Before I talk to anybody, we're going to search everything. Can open a cooking pot. Yeah, boy. Two good things. Without even asking, I'm just going to take it. You know why? Because I'm a BA, man. That's right. They could tell by looking at me they don't want to mess with me. Just let him go. Let her go through the stuff. Let her go through all the things. Just knife you. Some knife you as quick as look at you. See more matches right there. Well, this stuff will come in handy. So will those. Lots of matches. That's great. Those matches could be used up quick though. Cloth. Where's the food? Of course, we got 10, ten uh, sickly people in there that are, that are freezing to death, so. I may have to go out and forage here before long. I probably will, because I'm almost at, I'm Oh, coffee and herbal tea. Sweet. All right, that's better than nothing. That I, I can get some calories out of that. Accelerant. Can't get many calories, but I can get a little bit. All right, so. 
Don't worry, we're gonna go through that fr Oh, a hunting knife. Sweet. We'll go through that fridge in a minute. Okay, that's locked up. It won't even it won't even let me use the crowbar on this. Water bottle, I'll take it. Nothing there though. You're probably nothing in the microwave. Okay. I think we're good. All right, we got a cook pot. That's great for for uh, water. Talk to this dude, I guess. Walter White, oh. is it you? Hello. Uh, hello. Did you come from the crash site like the others? All the cots are taken, but you can sit by the fire, warm up a bit. I'll boil some water. The crash site. How did you know about the the crash site? Don't you remember? Another one suffering from shock, maybe. I crashed, but days ago, far from here. No, no. You crashed yesterday. In the hills. What? A terrible crashing sound. I even heard it over the howling blizzard. Don't you remember? Listen, I I'm sorry. You must be mistaken. I crashed, but not here. Oh, of course. Well, please stay and warm yourself by the fire until we can figure out where you belong. Where? <laughs> what is this place? Okay, here we go. This is the old community hall in Thompson's Crossing. We gathered people here when the weather started turning bad. Three, or was it four days ago? The houses became too cold. And it seemed better to bring everyone under one roof. Yeah. Then true. yesterday, the crash survivors started showing up. I'm thinking maybe these might be escaped convicts, Father. So, these people are all survivors of a crash? Well, most of them, yes. There were maybe half a dozen people in and around the town site when the blizzard first hit. Over the past day or so, the rest have slowly arrived. Most of them from the crash site. What crashed? A passenger airliner, best I can tell. Dang. Most of the people who arrived were too weak to talk about it. But judging by the thundering sound and the size of the fire on the hills, whatever crashed up there, it must have been something big. Are you sure? You don't remember the crash? He's not listening. How long do you think this weather will last? You're not from around here, are you? I just crashed! Whoever named this area Pleasant Valley had a pretty good sense of humor. We get some of the harshest weather on all of Great Bear. But I mean, it's worse than usual? Yes. Another storm blew through about a few weeks ago. The worst I've seen in years. Block the roads, in and out. I'm afraid we're stuck here until the road's clear. Will someone come to check on the town? Clear the roads so you can get out? I don't think so. Not anymore. We'll have to wait for nature to take its course. But what will happen to all these people? They'll die. Honestly, <laughs> I'm not sure. We're down to our last food. We can melt snow for water, but that will only get us so far. At this time of year, there's always another blizzard around the corner. Things might be different if the power hadn't gone out. The best thing we can do is try to keep these people warm and fed, and then we'll see what the Lord has in store. Maybe we'll have to eat them. You seem disoriented, but you're in much better shape than the others. Maybe you can help us. I'm a doctor. I can have a look at the survivors and uh, see how to help them. That sounds like a good place to start. Once you've had a chance to check on them, come back, and we can try to figure out what can be done for them. All right, guys, and I think that's a great place to stop, as a matter of fact. This is Chapter 2, Fallen Star, coming up in the next episode. So check on the plane crash survivors in the hall. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and save this game right now. 
And I uh, hope you guys, let's overwrite that, confirm, accept. Okay, guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, go give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that right now. And tell me in the comment section what you think. Are these, uh, are these convicts? I didn't stop at that convict area, so I don't know what to expect. Anyway, guys, as I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you, and we'll see you in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye. Ha <laughs> ha.